we'll do this. Maybe Primarina's a little bit better. I kind of need Conkledor to deal with the, um... It does have Ice Punch. Yeah, I'm gonna have to bring Conkledor to deal with the, uh, opposing... With the opposing, uh, Delmise. It was on Cybertron's channel? Okay. A fast Rhyperior, that's kind of terrifying. Banded Rhyperior, I don't even want to think about that, bro. <laughs> Banded Rhyperior. Okay, so if I were them, I would just Trick Room right now. I would just Trick Room right now to reverse my Trick Room. Uh, but I'm not them. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to Moonblast the Urshifu. And also, I'm going to Water Spout for damage. Because honestly, like, there, there's no way that they don't Trick Room anticipating my Trick Room, right? They should Trick Room anticipating the Trick Room. I get my Moonblast off. We just absolutely delete that Urshifu. Unless they get the flinch here, which I would very much hate. And they get the flinch there. And they set up the Trick Room! Yay! <laughs> Hey, thank you, kind words only. See you living up to your name. All right, we'll just moonblast that thing right there, and I will once again go for the water spot because they can't do nothing about it. Specs right here. No, <laughs> don't even say that, dude. Don't say that blasphemy in my chat. Nightshade, that's not going to help you too much, bud. I mean, yeah. Maybe it'll live. Probably not. It did not. This thing's special defense is garbage. And I can heal myself up, man. I can heal myself up with the strength stab. It's going to be epic. It's going to be epic, dude. What are your rats' names? They are Jorno, Gold Experience, and Gur. Gur, as in like Gur from Invader Zim. Okay, uh, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna follow me. And I'm going to Strength Sap this Delmise. They might self Shadow Sneak, which I would love if I could just redirect that. I would love to redirect that right now. That'd be, an, that'd be amazing. Um, and I believe I'm slower than Delmise. I should be. At the very least. I believe Jellison's got like base 45 and Delmas has like base... Are they both 45? Let me see. I actually don't know these two. I, I should know these two. I don't. Someone's going to correct me in chat before I can even check, but... Delmas has base 40. Ooh, we might be slow. We might be slower under Trick Room. And uh, Jellicent is base 60. Oh, we're faster under. We're, we're, we're faster outside of Trick Room, so they're actually going to go before us. But I can live with that as long as they go for the... Oh, they paint split. Okay. Ah, uh, that's fine. Max Overgrowth. A. Hey, we catch him. Let's see if we live. I don't think we do. I, I, don't, I don't believe we do, but we haven't Dynamaxed yet, which is great. <laughs> That's great, actually. We have yet to Dynamax. And also, I have covered up half of my screen with Pokemon Showdown. Hello, guys. Hello. Okay, we get full health from that. Hello, Jellicent. You are healthy again, my friend. Thank you. Yeah, Delmise... I knew Delmise was in the 40s. Okay. Are you ready for this tech? Are you- you're not ready for this play. You're not ready for this play, guys. You see, he's gonna expect the Will-O-Wisp, but I'm gonna expect him to expect the Will-O-Wisp. So we're gonna click the- the bad move. We're gonna- we're gonna click the forbidden move one more time. <laughs> we're gonna click the forbidden move one more time. <laughs> oh. Can I get a forbidden move in the chat? Can I get a Nene in the chat? Can I get a Nene? Ah, uh, yes. Modest Scarf right here, team. Dude, I might. I might do it. Would you guys be interested in a YouTube series where I use garbage like that on Showdown? Ooh. 
Oh wait, did he nene us? Oh no. Oh yes. Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> oh, the forbidden move. Ehu. <laughs> Ehu. Bro, I'll click it again. 5 HP. Dude, Dustclops is nasty. I'm gonna click the Forbidden move one more time. Actually, you know what? I'm slower than this thing. I'm not gonna click the Forbidden move. I don't even need to. I don't even need to click the Forbidden move. He's gonna call me trying to click the Forbidden move. <laughs> so much HP. <laughs> and now we definitely live the next one. That's the funny part. Please do it into the dust clops. <laughs> <laughs> the forbidden move. Ally switches dust clops stand. Dude, yes. Hello, I'll be taking your attack stat now. <laughs> this is such a good move. And his Dynamax is just completely wasted. Just entirely wasted, dude. Like, just gone. Absolutely gone. Also, it's interesting he's running Leftovers and not Weakness Policy. Okay. I'll be taking your Pokemon now. Dude, if he has Haze, I'll cry. But he would have clicked it by now, right? Let me, uh, Shadow Ball onto the Dusclops. Actually, I'll just Shadow Ball Dalmize. I should live every hit now. So I can max Hailstorm for free. Can you bring Dolman back? Eventually, man. Okay, that's fine, dude. What am I catching? Vanillax? Dude, you're not taking this. I'm going to keep it real with you guys. I forgot he had another Pokemon in the back. I'm going to keep it real with you. But if we're lucky, this combination of moves will just knock it out and then we can Strength Set. Here's the Shadow Ball. Max Hailstorm. I kind of hope he Trick Rooms again. Uh, not quite. Critical hit, too. Amazing. Phenomenal. Will-O-Wisp. Are we Guts? I hope we're Guts. That'd be amazing if we were Guts. Tell me we're Guts. I actually don't know. I legitimately am not certain. Ooh, there's a rat on my leg. Tell me we're Guts. Rat on the leg. What will he do? Dang, this is taking a minute. Sub badge is almost done. Gotcha, Atrix. Iron Fist. No! <laughs> Not like this. Not like this. Um, I will Shadow Ball you. And now I need the attack boost. Hello. Please don't switch out. Please don't switch out. I would very much like my attack boost. Thank you. So we can no longer Strength Sap. That's fine. I'm gonna Shadow Ball anyways. Does a little under half. Max Knuckle. It's going to give me the attack boost I need. There are so many rats just swarming me right now. Show camera the rats. Uh, yeah, as soon as they decide to come into frame, man. How does one give a team? You would join the Discord. Alright. Dude, this there are so many effects going on at the end of the turn. Alright, uh, so that's great. That's great, actually. He actually nightshaded, which means we're able to go for another strength up. 
Uh, the fact that he has leftovers makes me think he has protect on this thing, so I kind of want to play it safe. I kind of really want to play it safe and just try to remove the Jellicent. So what I'll do here is I'll Shadow Ball into the Dusclops. And that plus Max Hailstorm should do it. So I'm assuming Protect and the Delmize in the Trick Room is their play. Rat. Hey, we called it. Thank you, Mr. Rat. Thank you, Mr. Rat. I have a nice Night Prince pod. Oh, please tell me that's enough to KO. It's probably not, and I just lost. It's probably not, and I just lost because of it, isn't it? Come on. Come on. Oh! Yes! Okay, we win. We win. Yeah, you would just post the team in rental teams. Okay, so we're faster than him. We're faster than him, which means we can Strength Zap. But it'd be much faster just to Shadow Ball. Shadow Ball Ice Punch should do it. Especially since he's not Assault Vest. Yeah, that nearly just KO'd. Epic, dude. Epic, we got him. Have a nice night, Prince Bot. I don't know if I already said it. How do I record my game on the Switch? Capture card. I have a, I have an external capture card. I feel like the... I wish my, like my TV wasn't quite as bright. Alright, uh, that is... They have no Trick Room setter, yet a Trick Room team. Interesting. Um, not sure how to feel about that. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't go Trick Room mode versus them, clearly, right? I'm not that stupid. Let's go Trick Room mode. Uh, <laughs> it looks like Primarina gives them the work. Or it could. Conkledor actually looks really nice, in fact. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I meant to switch teams. My bad, guys. I meant to switch teams. Okay. Here's what I'll do. Gonna go Jellicent. Conkledor. Gonna go Primarina. Gonna go Dusclops. Give him the work, you know? And while that's happening, I'm gonna go make a massive deposit in the bathroom. Time me. I'm gonna wash my hands, I swear. Okay, but the real mystery is, did I actually wash my hands? And my response is, you'll never know. Alright. So, looks like they went Dragalgical Fable. I can live with that. I can live with that. In fact, check this out. Oh wait, how slow is Dragalge? How slow is Dragalge? I believe it's also 40. 44, okay, so... Conkledur is slightly faster, unfortunately. Um... I can go hard Primarina here. And I think I'm just gonna Water Spout for damage. I'm gonna go hard Primarina on what I assume to be a Dynamax Dragon move. At least I believe that's their best play. I would assume that's what they go for. What would Ally Switch Requiem be? Uh, follow me. <laughs> Ally Switch Requiem is just follow me. Actually, no. Ally Switch Requiem would be like 
It would be a lot like King Crimson. You see the future, and you can tell that they're definitely going to be targeting into that slot. And then you just say, okay, yeah, we're good. And and then just ally switch. So unfortunately, uh, they just decide not to do at all what I believe they would do. Which is very scary. Bro, they didn't even follow me. That hurts me as a, as a VGC player. Okay. The safety goggles on the Clefable. I'm gonna click the Forbidden Move. I'm gonna attempt to Moonblast that thing. Yeah, obviously, obviously I washed my hands. Easy. Who would do this if they didn't? You'll never know. I faced down a Clefable and Clefairy at once. It was a strange experience. What? That sounds terrifying. Alright, so hopefully we get the poison move into this dust collapse here. Yep, there it is. Also, they're a uh, relatively fast Dragalge. Wow! Okay, that did a lot. Alright. Um. I'm about to do what's known as a pro gamer move. Check this out. They're going to anticipate me to uh, ally switch again, so I'm just going to trick room on them. I'm just going to trick room on them. Nice haircut. Thank you. They're going to anticipate the ally switch again. I'd be a madman not to do it again. There's a dazzling gleam. Okay, I can live with that. Okay, no. Uh, I, I have gotten too lucky too long. Uh, but luckily, luckily though, we do get to get in the uh, the dust clops in the trick room. Or the... the What's his name? <laughs> the conkledor in the trick room. You would just join the Discord to uh, send some teams in. Alright, Clefairy... Or Clefable is within Nightshade range. So, uh, I believe... I believe my play here is just to throw out the raw ice punch. Which is stronger? I believe Max Hailstorm is actually stronger, so we'll do that. And I'll just Nightshade. So we're going to get some pretty solid damage off here. I think we just straight up one-shot the Dragalge. Since it's not Dynamaxed and we have a massive attack stat. And if they brought even a slightly fast mode to this game, we're good. Alright. Sorry, I was checking my phone. Alright, they are going to protect, that is fine. We're going to delete this thing from the field. I believe we're going to delete it. I mean, it's, it's a pretty strong hit. It, it's a pretty strong hit, man. Okay, yeah, that thing's gone. Incredible. Absolutely phenomenal. So hopefully the rest of their team is just super, super fast. I'd very much appreciate that if we just have a super fast matchup now. But what if I ally switched, though? But imagine if I ally switched. 
Okay, I can live with this. Check this out. We'll max Knuckle here. And I will Nightshade the Clefable. I don't think anything really wants to come in on this. Even if Ferrothorn protects, it's not in a very good spot. Because what does Ferrothorn do to, <laughs> to Conkeldur, really? What does it even do to Conkeldur? Yeah, I don't really mind the Ferrothorn protecting. Like, I still get the same KO. No, he just... What? <laughs> what? Is this thing Assault Vest? Are we facing Assault Vest Ferrothorn? I've seen that before. It's been picking up. Assault Vest Ferrothorn has been picking up, which is annoying. Bro, I'm ally switching next turn. I don't care. What? Do we crit? Okay, yeah, we crit. I was gonna say, there's no way that just straight up KO'd. That'd be so dumb if that was just how it KO'd. Fellas, uh, it's time to send the Nene emote. I would like a Nene in the chat at this point. Get it out of here. <laughs> Get that man some milk. Yeah, no, he just... Dude, it's funny, because, like, my non-max move does more damage than my max move. Oh, it's pre-marina. Well, I'm very I'm very happy we have this move. Max lightning and nightshade should do it. And, and check this out, check this out. If he protects this turn, I'm not even going to ally switch next turn. He doesn't, so we just win. But if he were to protect, I wouldn't even ally switch, because that's what he would expect. He'd be like, hmm, yes, he's going to ally switch. And then I'd be like, no, I'm not. I'm going to win. Because <laughs> I'd have to be insane to, to not ally switch that turn. You know what's bad when a, when a max move is stronger than a... Or when a non-max move is stronger than a max move. Yeah. Yeah, big... Oh! Why does this entire team just... Just doo-doo all over this Thwacky. This Thwacky is getting doo-dooed on, dude. Dang, I really wanted to use it, too. Um, So it looks like it's just going to be focusing around the uh, G-Max Flapple. Uh, what I would like to do is set up a situation where they'd be half, where they would have to be absolutely insane to not go for the for the dragon move. So I'm going to lead off Duraludon and Talonflame, and I'm going to switch in Clefable immediately. And... Uh, I think my last Pokemon is going to have to be this, um, this Tarak, the Tarak in the back. Or, mm, you know what, I don't care. I'm going to bring the Thwacky. I'm going to bring the Thwacky in the back, and it's going to be a phenomenal game. It's an auto loss, you can't be Dolman. Dude, if you guys remember the Dolman meme, shout out to you, that's like a year old meme now. All right. Tell me it's Town Flaming. Okay, well, that's not exactly what I wanted, but it's also Water Urshifu, which means we chose the right lead. Alright, uh, what we'll do here is we'll actually just go hard into Clefable, anyways. And. I'll just do a wing beat. I'll just, I'll just do a wing beat. I'm gonna keep it real with you. I think he's gonna target into the, uh, into the Duraud on here. Wow, that does nothing. Thank you, Sharp Beak. You're so good. As they Tailwind, hopefully I'll be able to match that next turn. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, uh, that's fine. So, what's epic about this turn? What, what What's absolutely epic about this turn? Is that this turn we get to follow me, right? And I'm actually just going to remove that thing from the field. Because they could taunt me, but I get to remove that thing for free. Ooh, what if they don't taunt me, though? What if what if they what if they just try to break my Gale Wings? What if they just break my Gale Wings, though? That wouldn't be fun. Or no, they just Bray Bird. Cool, cool. I'm going to do it again. I'm, I'm just going to do it again. Uh, I'm not within Aqua Jet range. And also, their Gale Wings is now broken because they're running the worst Town Flame move. 
I I'll be honest with you guys. Uh, I feel like dual wing beat is only good on Talonflame and Scyther, and apparently Scizor, as we learned from earlier in the stream. And that's just because, like, Talonflame doesn't lose health from it. That's literally the only reason. What's switching in on this? Give me your Flapple. That's fine. I'm going to Tailwind. I'm, I'm just going to Tailwind, bro. I'm, I'm just going to Tailwind. And this is going to take, like, two. Oh, that actually does a decent amount. I guess that makes sense. More people are running special defensive Clefairy in retrospect, or in <laughs> since we see a lot of um, since we see a lot of poor Yen Z in the ladder. Defog just to fly. Yeah, I'm confused about the defog. I don't know why we have that, but it's funny. In comes the Droudon. and I think I can time this just right. Where? Let me see. Let me see. They have one more turn of Tailwind. Okay, and they don't have priority on their next Tailwind. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and go for this Max Steel Spike. I'm going to set up my Tailwind. I can also just Dual Wing Beat. That'd be pretty epic. I'll Tailwind, though. I'll, I'll get up my Tailwind priority. Hopefully they just target into the uh, you know, the boy here. But I should be able to knock out that, that Talon Flame with, um, with uh, my Dual Wing Beat next turn. There's the follow me. That's fine. I was hoping for that. I would very much enjoy like a flare blitz into my into my boy rather than anything. Ah, no, that's fine though. That's fine, I guess. Because we're gonna be faster next turn and we still KO with dual wing beat. In fact, they might just KO themselves. No, not quite, but that's fine. That's perfectly fine. Get the defense boost. And that might allow me to live the uh, Aqua Jet from the from the um, Urshifu, depending on how bulky this Town Flame is. All right, check this out. I'm going to go ahead and max Wormwind into their boy. In the off chance they have Aqua Jet, which they probably do. They probably have the Aqua Jet. But, I'm also going to try to dual wing beat. I'm just going to double into this thing. It doesn't really matter. Hopefully they just detect here. Oh! Hello? Hello. Is, is it me you're looking for? I don't get the point of that. I don't get the point of that play. Um, because I didn't have Gale Wings. Okay, well, here's the funny part. Um, <laughs> we get to send in the Thwacky and get a KO. <laughs> Thank you uh, for whoever sent me this team, because now I have YouTube content. Thwacky, the Galar champion. What's up, Thwacky? Random chimp of it. <laughs> okay. Uh, so we have Tailwind, so we're actually faster than this whole team. I'm going to max Wormwind into that thing, and I'm actually just going to go ahead and go for the Grassy Glide into uh, into this guy. Because it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. The MVP has now arrived. Yes, big facts. Big facts. Big facts. The monkey is here. Epic monkey moment. Oh, you can try to protect yourself. But guess what? Guess what? You're only delaying the inevitable. The wacky is going to get a KO this game. That's just how things are. That's how things are going to be. The whack champ. The thwack in the back. And we're lowering that thing's attack, dude. You're not living this, man. You can try. You're gonna get gra you're gonna get glizzy glided. <laughs> this man's gonna get glizzy glided. Oh, is that is that a flapple? Is that a flapple? You think you're gonna live with your your new stupid flapple? All right, Draco Meteor, this man. I've had enough of him, and we're gonna glizzy glide. 
<laughs> Can I get a glizzy glide in the chat? When they introduced Grassy Glide is when the Glizzy Glugger meme was, was popular, so now I just say Glizzy Glide. He's still taking teams? I'm probably not going to get to him. I'm probably not going to get to him, unfortunately, so I wouldn't really bother dropping him. Dude, I don't care. Your special defense is garbage. You will succumb to the Glizzy Glide. Here's what's going to happen. He's going to go for a physical move. I already have plus one defense, so I'm living it. I'm living it. I'm living this hit. I can guarantee you that. I can guarantee you that. And then he's going to get KO'd by Glizzy Glide. And he doesn't get it. There's the Glizzy. He just got glided. How long am I streaming? I'm going to be streaming for about another 30 minutes, probably. Draco Meteor. Man got Glizzy glided. <laughs> beautiful. An absolutely beautiful game. Thank you, monkey. Thank you. I'd like, to, I'd like everyone to say thank you, monkey.